Hello YouTube and welcome back to my channel, Ali the Mystical Fairy. I'm Melissa and I will be reading your cards today. In this video, we are doing a timeless pick a card reading on what have people noticed about you lately. I will have three piles for you to choose from. Pile one, I'll be using the Light Series Tarot deck. For pile two, I'll be using the Modern Witch Tarot deck. And for pile three, I'll be using the Radiant Wise Spirit Tarot. So please choose whichever pile resonates with you the most. Hello, pile one. If you chose this bracelet, this will be your reading. I hope you've been doing well, pile one. Let's see what people have noticed about you lately, okay? I want to pull an angel message for you real quick. All right, Spirit, what's the angel message for my power ones? What is the angel message for my power ones? We have the number 23. You could be 23 here or the number 23 can be significant to you. You have a zest for life and you are eager to experience anything and everything possible. You love change and excitement and need both to feel truly alive. For you, life is an adventure to be lived to the fullest. I am adventurous. So maybe people have noticed that you seem a little bit more free-spirited, that you seem a little bit more adventurous. Um, you could be in like an exploring mood, like in an exploring mood right now. Um, you might be coming off as a little bit curious, okay? I'm also getting that people notice that you may be asking more questions or you're asking a lot of questions. Um, let's see here. Let's get into the tarot. I definitely feel like you could be an air sign or a fire sign watching here, okay? You could be traveling more. Maybe people are noticing that you're traveling or just going to new places that you haven't um, been to. All right, Spirit God, ancient ancestors, please give me the most accurate messages for my power ones. All negative energy will be sent back to the sender and please protect my power ones from all negativity. Thank you. All right, Spirit. What have people been noticing about my power ones lately? What have people been noticing about my power ones lately? What have people been noticing about my power ones lately? What have people been noticing about my power ones lately, Spirit? What have people been noticing about my power ones? We got the Ten of Cups. Okay. What have people been noticing about my power ones lately spirit what have people been noticing about my power ones so we have the ten of cups we have the world we have the emperor and we have the five of swords so we do got some aries energy here and some air energy um gemini libra aquarius we also have cancer pisces scorpio coming out so when i did see the ten of cups um you could be um People have noticed that you seem very happy with your family, um, whether this is your own family or you've created a family with your um, of your own. I'm also getting here that people have noticed that you may um, be healing your childhood traumas or um, like family trauma here. Um, you seem very like accepting or calm. Um, there's something about like the past here that I feel like you're kind of like letting it be. I feel like you're just a lot more calm, more like accepting of like you can't change the past. Okay, maybe that's something that you realize. Um, but yeah, I feel like people have noticed that you seem a lot more free. Like there's been like a weight lifted off of your shoulders. And this may be because you're healing some type of trauma here. Maybe like some type of childhood trauma or some type of um, family trauma. I don't know. But it seems like you're healing that within yourself. I'm also getting like a specific message that you're healing that with your own family or like um with your kids or something like that you're healing your childhood trauma 
with your children okay by um by like breaking generational cycles or um just treating your children maybe as you want it to like as you wanted your own family to treat you as a child um i definitely see that here so yeah people have noticed that i feel like there's just this lightweight um change around you um and you just seem a lot more free okay i feel like people have noticed that you've entered a new cycle i feel like this could be a like a physical change as well um you just seem to be glowing a lot um i feel like you've been smiling a lot lately people have been noticing that you have been happy um even in like your voice okay your voice may seem a, a lot more cheerful okay i definitely feel like you're creating some type of new cycle with the family and like i i even feel like this could be like your family of your own like maybe you have maybe y'all have reached some sort of like not conclusion but some sort of um like ac acceptance from both parties okay and i feel like this is allowing you to heal and create new experiences with your family here okay when well, you see very happy um with the emperor here i definitely feel like you are in your power people notice this boss like energy around you um and i don't want to say you're bossy or anything like that but it's almost coming off as a little bit authoritarian or like authoritative, but not really. I think it's just because you see, you, you could be very wise here. You could be a lot, uh, a little bit older here. Um, or you could be younger, but just have a more mature mindset. And I feel like you kind of come off that way because you always know the right thing to say or you always have like you're always right okay um or you always give the right advice so you may come off as a little bit like bossy in a way but i feel like it's just because you know you're very wise and you've been through certain situations you could also be using your intuition with this as well your intuition could tell you certain things so that you're so that you can basically help other people as well <clears throat> i feel like people people are noticing how you've really changed and i don't know i'm getting like like a, a year like two years ago like maybe you were definitely not in like the spot that you're in right now or the position that you're in right now but i just feel like it's something to do with consistency here and like believing in yourself And I'm not saying that all your days are happy and perfect, although I hope that it is. But I know, you know, a lot of y'all want me, a lot of y'all like are really logical and realistic. I feel like for my power ones, um, but you come off that way to other people. Like, like a, it's an everyday thing for you to just be, to just be happy and go lucky but it's really because you had to heal yourself and it took time like it took hard work to consistently try to build yourself up from nothing or build yourself up and kind of give yourself that nurturing that you that you needed like nurturing your inner child but it's really like you needed that in the past like when you were you know act when you were an actual child but I feel like you've been trying to nurture your inner child and nurture yourself as a whole. And I feel like you're finally healing like some type of family or childhood trauma. 
and it's just been looking so good onto you and also like i just feel like people like people have noticed this and like people can't really project onto you anymore you know because maybe you were in a certain vibration sorry maybe you were in a certain vibration when you used to kind of have these issues and maybe you will attract people or attract people saying you know certain things um maybe like about family or you know like people can't project onto you anymore okay and i don't know what that's about i'm trying to like think of an example here like i don't know maybe like you attracted people who will basically put you down or maybe say something about your family or something like that here but it's like now that you're healing that like people can't project that negativity onto you like maybe like people thought like you would never heal some type of trauma right no matter what type of trauma you have maybe people thought you would never heal or they tried to keep you in that like, I don't want to say, like, victim energy, but try to keep you in that energy as in, like, you will you won't heal. Like, you can't really grow above this or, you know, you can't really, like, let it go. But I feel like something has allowed you to heal something. You've been able to let it go. And people have noticed, like, like it, it doesn't affect you. Like, maybe even attract the people who would, like, comp maybe, like, complain or, or, like, be in the same situations as you. And maybe they haven't been able to heal, right? But maybe they still like talk to you and maybe they like kind of project you know a little bit onto you and i feel like it doesn't affect you anymore um because you're healing yeah i hope you understood what i was saying power one but basically I'm just saying that people, you know, sometimes project or sometimes we can attract people that go through the same things as us or attract people who like to stay in a certain energy and like they don't like to heal or they don't like to kind of like look at the bigger picture. But I feel like you're finally seeing the bigger picture and you're finally healing. And I feel like people just can't, you know, they can't affect you anymore like you're rising above it you're seeing the bigger picture and i feel like you're finally being happy i'm also feeling like people are noticing that you're finally getting your flowers and you're you're finally getting the recognition that you deserve something has come full circle for you for sure What have people noticed about my power ones lately, Spirit? What have people noticed about the five of ones? We do have the five of swords and the five of ones here. Okay, let's see. What have people noticed about my power ones lately? The page of pentacles. What have people noticed about my, my power ones? lately what are people notice we got the death card yeah you have completely transformed yourself what are people notice about my power ones lately you could have converted to like another religion or like you could have um you could be spiritual here but whatever it's like you could have um you could have you could have adopted some new beliefs that's what people are noticing about you Okay, we got a lot of fives here. So we got the five of swords, five of ones, and the five of cups. Five, five, five could be significant to you. But yeah, I definitely feel like you have been, you even have the six of cups on the back of the deck. I definitely feel like you have been healing that past energy. Like maybe you used to have a lot of arguments with your family in the past. Um, and even if like you haven't completely healed with your family, it's like you've accepted something as yourself. Like maybe you no longer argue. Maybe you no longer give um, those people um, your energy, right? Um, you could have healed that within yourself and you could be nurturing yourself. You could be giving the love that you needed to yourself. Um, it doesn't necessarily mean you have to heal with these people because not everyone is going to be able to, you know, 
heal. But I also feel like family has noticed that maybe you just don't give them the time of day anymore. Um, maybe you just kind of, you know, maybe they try to start arguments with you and just like, whatever, like, I'm going to do me. <laughs> it has nothing to do with me anymore. Okay. We have the Page of Pentacles as well. People have noticed the opportunities that you've been getting. Okay. Maybe you just started some new a new school or maybe you have just like, you, you started doing something that could potentially make you lots of money in the future. I don't know if this is school, a hobby or something, but people have noticed that you've been, okay, I'm also getting yoga here. Also, if you've been working out or doing some sort of yoga meditation, I don't know. Um, it's been, it's definitely um, showing its results on your body. Um, meditation, I really feel like with med meditation, I feel like your aura has been glowing. If you've been working out, you're definitely, um, people are definitely seeing the results, okay? <clears throat> but yeah, you've been doing something like started something that could make you a lot of money in the future. People have noticed that here, that your ideas are... Okay, people notice that everything that you touch or everything that you do has the potential to be big or becomes big, literally. Like, people think you can do anything and it could make some sort of impact here. Like, every new cycle that you start, there's an opportunity for you. Like, literally, opportunities just be floating your way. I definitely think that People have noticed this change about you with the death in the emperor here. Maybe you didn't always believe in yourself or maybe you didn't always have this boss-like energy to yourself. But I feel like because of this new found, like because you've been healing, you've been seeing, you've been a lot more confident lately. And I feel like people are noticing the, that about you. Like you're going after what you say you're going to go after. Like you do everything that you say you're literally going to do. Yeah. People be noticing that about you. That you literally do whatever you say you're going to do. Okay. You might have a lot of people jealous because of that. Oh, so that's what this is. The Five of Swords and the Five of Cups. Maybe in the Six of Cups. But yeah, I feel like people be noticing that like... If you say you're going to get a job or you say you're going to move somewhere, you literally do it. And I feel like people, people be noticing that. And I feel like it kind of like, it confuses people. But I also feel like, you know, I feel like you have people feeling a certain way because maybe they like don't understand or didn't understand that you were serious, okay? But you, like, you you are a serious person. You could definitely be, like, an Aries here or um, a fire sign, an air sign, even earth sign here, maybe. Okay, but I feel like you're a serious person. It's, when it comes to your goals, like, and people be noticing that, and I feel like if you get mad, like, but it's, like, literally, you literally say you were going to do it. Like, what? What is the confusion about? But yeah, I don't know. I feel like every time you accomplish something, like people be noticing it and like they be feeling a loss in some sort of way. Like maybe they feel like they should have like stuck with you. Okay. And I feel like there's a little bit of jealousy there. These are definitely like past people. Okay. But yeah, power one, that is what I get for you. Um, you seem like a very adventurous person and a go-getter and people are noticing that about you. I just say keep going, okay? And I definitely feel like you are receiving your flowers or you will receive your flowers. And I wish you best of luck on your healing journey, okay? You're doing a good job, pal one. So yeah, that is what I have for you. Thank you so much for watching, Pal One. If you feel connected to me and my readings, don't forget to check out my Patreon. The link will be down in the description box below. And yeah, I will see y'all in my next video. Bye. Hello, Pal Two. If you chose this Amethyst Heart, this will be your reading. Y'all, I'm not gonna lie. Before I was about to start this video, I was singing this song. Um, I'm gonna take you home with me. I got money in the bed. Uh, 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 uh. 
Okay, pile two. I feel like people are noticing that you're a bad bitch, okay? Like, you could be a bad bitch here, okay? A bad witch, okay? <laughs> I don't know. I get this, like, this silly, like, hot boy, hot girl energy from you, okay? Maybe you're in your villain era, or maybe you're, like, in your I don't give a F era, okay? No matter how old or how, no matter how old you are, I feel like you, you're in your bad B era, okay? Let's see here, let me get an angel message for you. Uh, give me an angel message from my power two spirit. Give me an angel message for my pile, please. Number 66. Your guardian angel is teaching you the essence of un unconditional love. You are encouraged to have faith that the universe will provide for you while you are manifesting your inner desires. I am positive, okay? So maybe people are noticing that you are positive here. Okay. Pile 2, this kind of reminds me of me. Like... You may be, you may do stuff like, <clears throat> like you may manifest things for yourself. Like, I feel like I used to manifest things for myself by like, like say I wanted to go somewhere. I would literally just buy like the plane ticket, even though like not knowing like if I'm gonna be able to go or if I'm gonna even have like the resources to go. But I end up like, randomly getting the resources or randomly getting the money and everything that I need to be and and have fun and vacation um so maybe that's the way that you manifest or maybe that's how like you're wanting to be okay or maybe people are noticing that about you like maybe the way that you manifest you could manifest in your own like special way okay because everybody manifests differently you could like manifest the way that I just mentioned, or you could have your own thing. And I feel like maybe people kind of see you as like um, really ambitious or very free spirited. Like I got that for pile one, but I feel like pile two, you're very free spirited at this moment. And I don't know why I just get this like, I don't wanna say wild energy, but I just get this very like, I don't care like, I'm here, like, um, life is short, like, I'm gonna live, like, that's what I get for foul too, like, really, okay, um, so let's see what comes out for you, let's see, here. spirit God, ancient ancestors, please give me the most accurate messages for my pal twos, all negative energy will be sent back to the sender, and please protect my pal twos from all negativity, thank you. Let's see what comes out for you. Yeah, I feel like you are very positive. Are you are very happy? Okay, 2024 is your year. I felt called to tell that to you. 2024 is your year. Okay, keep being positive. Okay, and keep going after the things that you want in your dreams. Because people notice that about you. They notice how much of a go getter you are. Okay, let's see. All right, Spirit, what have people been noticing about my pile twos lately? What have, what have people been noticing about my pile twos lately? What have people been noticing? Justice, okay, let's see. Libra energy coming out. I just saw the six of wands. Okay, let's see. What have people been noticing about my pile twos lately, Spirit? What have people been noticing about my pile twos? Who been noticing about my pile? The hanged one in the sun. Oh, yes, Leo energy. I definitely feel like you've been happy. I don't know, maybe things have been going your way. People are noticing that things are going your way. Like, really? Okay, I do feel like people are noticing that 
you have good karma on your side or some some sort of good luck okay and this may be because um maybe the scales have been unbalanced for you in the past and that's why i get this energy like maybe you were so caught up in your head in the past maybe a little bit fearful and i just feel like i don't know i just get this new energy like i'm gonna do what i want i'm a bad b like I don't care what you say. I don't care what you do. Like, you can't tell me shit. But basically what I was saying, pal, too, is, is just that, you know, maybe some people, maybe you've been a little bit fearful in the past or you could have even gotten, like, bullied in the past or you've been treated, like, dirty in the past, okay? And I just feel like, you know, you're finally just realizing that, you're finally just being yourself, okay? Maybe you just realize you can't please anyone. Maybe you've actually gone through a lot here. Um, people like treating you like weirdly or something like that here. And it's just like, I just feel like you're you're growing from that. I feel like you realize you can't please everyone. So you might as well just do what you want to do here. That's what I get from you. And I feel like you've been so happy. This is your good karma, okay? And I feel like you're going to be doing a lot of the things that you've been wanting to do. And I feel like you're going to be getting a lot of the wishes that you have been, you know, wishing for. Um, and this is just all because you're being yourself. Um, and I just feel like spirit is gifting you with the things that you want. So yeah, people are noticing that you seem a little bit different. Okay, that's how I feel. You seem a little bit different. Um, and it's not even like, I feel like people would say that, like, call this your villain era or something, but it's not even that. I just feel like, you know, sometimes when we start being ourselves and we start being more selfish with ourselves, people can kind of see that as like a negative thing. Um, maybe you've just been a people pleaser for too long. Maybe someone made you seem like you couldn't do the things that you wanted to do. It always had to, you always had to put others first. And I feel like you're finally putting your, yourself first and people like feel like you're just, you're a bad, you're a bad bitch for literally doing this. It, it's just coming off of you just because of this confidence and, and this happiness and this acceptance of self has been radiating off of you, okay? And, you know, I don't know. I just feel like you had enough of, um, you had enough of people, you know, telling you what you can and can't do, like, literally. And you're grown. Like, that's what I'm getting here. Like, someone's like, I'm grown, like, <laughs> okay? But yeah, people are noticing that. And you may have even, like, caused people to act a certain way towards you, but it's literally just because you're like, like you seem a lot freer and a lot more happier now. Um, I just feel like even when you get around people, people wanna like be in this energy that you're in. Um, you light up the room here. noticing about my pile twos lately spirit what have people been noticing about my pile twos lately what have people been noticing about my pile twos what have people been noticing about my pile twos the king of pentacles oh i got money in the bank period um, and the nine of pentacles on the back of the day see i just feel like your wishes are finally coming true People may, you seem very satisfied. Um, you could be definitely sitting on your throne right now. I'm getting like a Virgo Capricorn Taurus energy here. Like, that's what I'm saying. I feel like you be manifesting like the way that I said earlier. Like knowing that you're gonna have the resources, knowing you're gonna have the money and just going for it, taking the risk, right? 
um but you, honestly you seem very stable right now people are noticing that you're very stable and i also do feel like you could be having people telling you that or like people be trying to like get be in your business about your money or maybe people say that you don't have it like it seems you do but i feel like it doesn't even affect you like that like i feel like people who actually have something they never have to flaunt it um or they never have to do too much they never have to say too much so maybe you don't have to say too much like it doesn't affect you um because you know that you you're stable um you're literally the king of pinnacles um You could have a good job here as well, or a new job here. People have noticed that. But yeah, I feel like people's like opinions of you, like it, it doesn't really phase you because you know who you are. Um, you don't have to fight about it. You don't have to respond back. It's like, I'm gonna let you think that of me. <laughs> and you know, you continue to, Sh um, not even show off but prove them wrong like really good cards pile two let's see what are people noticing about my pile twos what do people notice about my pile twos lately what have people noticed about my pile twos lately the emperor wow and the Hierophant, oh my gosh. The Emperor and the Justice, yeah. I definitely feel like it's just your turn. Like maybe you're just getting your turn now and you're finally seeing that it's your turn to um, be on top, okay? I'm also getting that like maybe you've had to kind of like shed your past self here or you may have to let go of a lot of people because I did get a message earlier saying like it was just like you know you being in this bad bitch energy it kind of it kind of like made maybe the insecure people in your life kind of like look at you sideways or maybe look at you as someone like differently because i feel like people are noticing that you're you're acting differently you're going about things differently now and i feel like it kind of made the people who are insecure in your life you know maybe you know you have to cut some people off here because i just feel like you're going your own way and i'm not saying that you don't completely listen to other people but i feel like you definitely realize that you're not listening to other people that are literally not happy in their own lives so it's like you know, you don't even know what you want. How are you gonna tell me? Like that's how the this is the energy that I get from you, pal too. Okay. But people have noticed this about you and maybe you know you kind of ruffled some feathers here. Okay. But it's your turn, you know. This is literally written for you. It's your turn. <clears throat> With the Hierophant and the Hanged One here, I definitely feel like people have noticed that you've become very wise and very open to people's bullshit and deception here. Like I said, maybe you've been a people pleaser or something like that in the past here. And I feel like you kind of like open your eyes here. And this could be because of some, like because of God, um, or maybe like some spiritual practices have opened your mind more. Like maybe you started meditating more or something like that. Really tapping into yourself and the source. And something here kind of just opened your eyes to basically how, you know, how people were in your life. And I feel like that's why you're in this energy now. You may have honestly, I don't know how old you are here. It doesn't matter how old you are really you can be in this energy regardless but someone here may feel like they wasted their time and i want to say that 
this was not a waste of time like if you if you had people in your life or you've been through certain cycles with people it was not a waste of time because if you didn't go through that you would literally not be who you are now okay we always have to learn through lessons you know you literally would not be who you are now the when we go through stuff we become smarter and wiser and that's is that's exactly what has happened to you here you didn't waste any time and you deserve to be in this energy now because it's it's been gifted to you okay this happened at the right time um you're getting everything that you want now because it is the right time for you to get the things that you want all right let's see a lot of people have been noticing about my pile twos lately what have people been noticing about my pile twos lately spirit the nine of swords see I just feel like you have people like your happiness like i feel like when people notice like your happiness here um like people just started kind of like just you know feeling indifferent like i don't not indifferent but you may have made other people anxious like being around you because your energy is so bright and bold now um but this could also mean that you know in the past like like i said maybe you were in this anxious energy and something has allowed you to be free and not be controlled by fear and i honestly feel like this fear control was by people and i feel like people are noticing that you're not fearful anymore it's something about life that you just like you just you you want to enjoy your life like i feel like you don't want to be surrounded by people who like hate their lives and that's why i got earlier like you don't accept advice from people who hate their lives. Is what I get. I don't know. Somebody here believes that or says that they don't accept people's advice from people who literally hate their lives. Like, maybe you said that to someone or thought that about someone. Like, how are you going to tell me? I don't know how to, but... <laughs> yeah but yeah people just noticed this and i feel like you kind of just like had you know i don't know you could be very truthful here as well and i'm not saying you're not you're mean or anything like that at all you could have just told someone the truth and was just like i'm not dealing with this no more like you know you're you're draining my energy or you're putting me down and maybe someone just kind of felt a little bit sad about that here all right let's see are a little bit bothered by like your energy but don't worry about them i mean you're telling them the truth and sometimes telling people the truth can help them grow too all right what are people noticing about my power twos lately what have people been noticing about my power twos lately judgment yeah that's why i said see some people may that's the thing i feel like some people could judge you or like they probably like people be putting their own judgments and i just feel like it's their own projections like people might say oh you really don't have it like that but like you literally just let people believe whatever they say like or people may just say things like oh this person's you're not really that happy or they're putting on some sort of facade here and i literally just feel like you literally just let them believe whatever they want because it's not even like you can convince people otherwise like it's like why would you even waste your time and breath to argue when you can literally be somewhere else doing something else um so yeah i feel like you don't even give these people the time of day but yeah people have just been noticing the change in your energy i don't like i kind of just get this wild vibe from you but not like too wild it's just that like maybe you're in your power now like something has made you step into your power and honestly power too i just feel like you've been through a lot um you've been through a lot to get here and i just feel like you 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 may feel like you wasted your time but i don't think that's true but i feel like maybe you feel like you like you focus too much on other people and the things that honestly you had no interest in, interest in doing and you're just like you're finally realizing it's my life like I'm going to do what I want. And people are noticing that about you, okay? You may have even ruffled some feathers here, but you're resilient regardless, pile two, okay? 
so yes power two that is what i get for your energy take what resonates and leave the rest um if you feel connected to me and my readings don't forget to check out my patreon the link will be down in the description box below and i will see y'all in my next video bye hello power three if you chose this orange selenite crystal this will be your reading i hope you've been doing well power three i'm gonna get an angel message for you real quick all right let's see Spirit, give me an angel message for my pal threes here. Give me an angel message for my pal threes. Give me an angel message for my pal threes. We have the number 31 here. So it says, I am disciplined. Your approach to life is an effective mix of both practicality and imagination. Your mind is stirring with creative ideas and you have the organizational skills to manifest them to life. Okay, you could be 31 watching here or the number 31 could be very significant to you. All right, so people could be noticing that you are very disciplined. Um, maybe you've been setting standards for yourself, okay? um and people are noticing that you're trying to accomplish something okay maybe because of these standards that you you set okay maybe also people have noticed that you've set some sort of boundaries here and you may have set these boundaries because you need to you feel like these boundaries will give you um will help you focus and get you closer to success here Okay, so let's see. Let's get a message for you. Spirit God, ancient ancestors, please give me the most accurate messages for my power threes. All negative energy will be sent back to the sender. And please protect my power threes from all negativity. Thank you. All right, let's see what's going on with you, power three. Spirit, what have people been noticing about my power threes lately? What have people noticed about my pal threes lately? We got the world coming out, okay? Let's see. What have people noticed about my pal threes lately? What have people noticed about my pal threes lately? We also have the emperor. What have people noticed about my pal threes lately? What have people noticed about my pal threes lately, spirit? In the ace of cups. What have people noticed about my pal threes lately? Page of Wands. Yeah. People notice, like I said, you seem very consistent. Um, very in your your passionate energy. Maybe you've been inspired by something or someone. Okay. We got Aries energy here, Aries Leo Sagittarius. We also have Cancer Pisces Scorpio energy as well, all right? I feel like people have noticed that you, how different you are in, um, because of this new cycle that you have entered here. And I'm getting that it's, some, it's a message here that like you're not doing things that you were, um, doing before or you're not handling situations the way that you handled them before okay um i'm also getting a message of stoop down to their level like you're not stooping down to someone's level anymore um but yeah i feel like you've started a new cycle here and um you've been really in your boss energy lately and I just feel like people are noticing that you're very truthful. Because we have the Ace of Swords on the back of the deck here. And I feel like people are noticing there's a lot of truth in what you say. Okay, it's kind of, I get it like a little bit of power to energy where you like say you're going to do something and like people notice that you actually do it. Okay, because maybe like there's a lot of people who say they're going to do something and then they don't do it or they just be saying stuff just to say it like, I don't know. Um, but like people realize that you actually like you keep your word and this could even be like loyalty to other people. Like maybe people notice how loyal you are. Like If you're going to say if you say you're going to do something for someone, you're going to do it. 
Okay, people, if you have a business here, people are also noticing, like, your customers notice that you're loyal to them and that you put in your best work like you don't have ass your shit you feel like you're going you, you you know that you're whatever you put out you put a lot of heart soul and love into your work okay and people do notice that so don't like don't think that people don't notice that people your customers or your audience whoever they notice that you put a lot of hard work into your business and into what you do okay and there's a lot of love, okay? People notice how really loving you are. Um, you, I just feel like you're a real loyal person. But sometimes I feel like maybe you feel like you don't get that loyalty back. But it's really not about getting it back. I always say that don't expect things back from some people and it's okay to be loyal and to love someone just don't let them play in your face but sometimes people never experience the type of love and loyalty that you've given someone else and sometimes people be needing that so uh, you know don't feel bad you know don't stop being loyal don't stop being who you are just because you know you know some people don't have the capacity to do those things back to you and I feel like it's not something to really take personal so maybe people have been noticing that you don't take things personal okay like maybe if you fall out with someone you don't take it personal or maybe you go through something or maybe something say something to you and you don't take it personal you're just like oh well you, you just let it fly um But yeah, people notice how you could sew here. Something about clothing here. You could be like, you could be a model here. You want to be a model here. There's something about clothes, okay? Fashion designer. Okay, you have a lot of creativity with clothes. Something about a boutique here. Maybe you want to open a boutique here. People do notice like the way that you dress is very unique. Like I said, you could make your own clothes or just like, you know how to style yourself. People notice, people want you to style them. Like the people want you to style them. All right, but people do notice something about your, your style. Like it's different from other people. Like you're the type of person to be noticed like anywhere you go, like in public, if you go to the mall or something like that, people notice you because of your style or maybe how bold you look or how bold you, you are like with your style. You could have colored hair here. Um, but yeah, I feel like anywhere, like you get, you get stopped or people notice you. Like you're not one of those people who people just, you know, glance by. I feel like people notice you because of your uniqueness all right let's see Spirit. what do people notice what have people been noticing about my power ones lately what have people noticed about did i say power ones maybe check out power ones i think that i think i said that sorry if i did but check out power one if you feel guided to um what have people noticed about my power threes lately spirit what have people noticed about my pile of threes ten of swords ten of wands in the sun yeah i definitely feel like there's been some sort of ending here and i want to see what this ending is what was this ending with the ten of swords here spirit what was this ending with the ten of swords king of cups okay so maybe you've gotten out of a relationship so maybe people notice how much lighter and how much um healed you are because of some sort of relationship that may have ended for you yeah we got the tower moment on the back of the deck as well so yeah something has definitely ended maybe you got out of a relationship and people really notice like you're doing things differently and maybe you felt like you couldn't do certain things because you were with this person maybe this person like held you back here um this person could have been a cancer pisces scorpio but doesn't have to be but I, I feel like a relationship has ended with you. And now you feel like you're able to do whatever you want to do. Oh, I'm just getting something about clothes here. Someone here really likes to sew. And someone wants to open a boutique. 
but people are going to notice you like you may even have like an etsy shop or some shop online maybe even jewelry like you're going to be able to open your own shop like people you're going to get noticed like people are noticing your your business people feel like they can't get pieces from anyone else but you you put a lot of like i said you put a, a lot of hard work and, and and effort into your business this could have stressed you out a little bit but people are noticing that because it shows within your work and it also shows when people get your pieces in person like they, they just felt like i'm getting like a wow like a stunned look because of how beautiful your work is and they can feel it energetically like people are noticing your work they're gonna notice it don't feel like you've been going unnoticed you will get your flowers for that but yeah i feel like there's a lot of love within you um i just feel like you seem very happy a lot of like newness energy around you i feel like people are noticing that and um maybe you have a lot of new ideas okay or maybe like i said i feel like you're just going about things differently and i feel like you're being consistent in what you do and you literally say what you're say that you're going to do something and it literally happens for you you literally do it and a lot of people love that about you because it, it transfers to like people like you you're loyal to people like you're not going to bullshit people you're going to do exactly what you say you're going to do Like even with your business here, like you don't be like you don't scam people. Like people will notice that like you actually like what you what you bring to the table is what you bring to the table is whatever you said you was going to bring. Okay, you don't be you don't scam people. You don't um, you know you don't talk yourself. I mean it's like you can talk yourself up, but you don't you don't make it seem like the product isn't what it is basically. If you if you get what i'm saying like it's exactly how like your product and it should be talked up because it's exactly what you said it was going to be all right let's see what have people noticed about my pile threes lately what have people noticed about my pile threes lately spirit what have people noticed about my pile threes like the star Aquarius energy here, Leo energy, Aries energy here. <clears throat> People have noticed how healing you are. You might have also had some physical changes with your body as well. Or you could have dyed your hair. People notice that. I think I said that earlier, but people do notice like your hair um, is different. Okay, but you could have... Um, you could be working out here or on some new sort of like diet here. People notice that about you, um, that you're that you 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 eat differently. Okay, and it, it and I just feel like it comes from this inspiration, like these new beliefs that you have about yourself. Okay, people notice how good you look. And I'm so sorry. I keep talking about clothes, but it really does come back to clothes. I don't know what this is here. But I just keep, in, keep looking at this page of wands here. Do you see how they're dressed? Like, I feel like they just look... I feel like when I look at this, I feel like you power through. Like, you're so confident in the way that you dress. You're so confident about who you are and your uniqueness. And you get stopped. Like, you may, like, people notice you out. Maybe people compliment you a lot, like, when you go out. But people do really enjoy your energy here. Um, people notice how healing your energy is. People notice how much of a good luck charm you are. Um, I feel like people will be around you for good luck. Because maybe things, maybe positive things happen to other people and you, like, when they're around you. So maybe people, like, notice how much of a good luck charm you are.
we have the five of cups on the, on the back of the deck so you know exes somehow always come up in a reading but you know i do feel like someone here feels like they lost out on you and always people always like realize what they have when they lose it for some reason and um you know, I feel like maybe you've had, like, people help hold you back in the past. And you're like, now that this ended, like, I'm going to literally do what I want to do. Like, you seem more focused on your hobbies. And I feel like people are noticing that about you. And people notice how much hard work that you put in not into not only into your work business or job whatever you put a lot of hard work into yourself okay and i i do feel like people notice that you are still in a very loving and happy energy i do also feel like with power three you are constantly changing and evolving here and i just feel like even through these changes like i just feel like you like you kind of you've always had it within your heart to just be this sweet happy go lucky person um you kind of just brighten up people's days and i feel like people notice that about you like no matter what you go through you still like that is your foundation it's to give love and be loved like you are love pile three I don't know. I just felt God to say that. Everyone is love, but really power three. I just had to let you know that you are love. And people notice that, like I said, whenever they're around you, they feel like good luck. Like they feel, feel very much happy, very much energized around you. And you do have a special energy here. I think people people are very happy to be around you. Also, if you like tell some sort of like stories here, people are very happy to listen to you as well. Okay, Pal Three, that is what I get from you. Um, take what resonates and leave the rest. Um, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and check out my Patreon if you feel connected to me and this reading, okay? And I will see y'all in my next video. Bye!